Mursali. Today, all of us, our society, our families, our world, is threatened by this pandemic, which made everybody reflect about the very essence of what this life is about. We may be experiencing some hardships, but the real benefit of reflecting upon this hardship is to think about the real purpose of creation, the real power of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, the real duty that we have. When we recite the book of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala as the month of Ramadan is upon us, this month of Quran, in it there is guidance. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala tells us, قُلْ لَا يُصِيبَنَا إِلَّا مَا كَتَبَ اللَّهُ لَنَا هُوَ مَوْلَانَا وَعَلَى اللَّهِ فَلْيَتَوَكَّلِ الْمُؤْمِنُونَ Nothing will befall us except that which Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has written for us. But then Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, هُوَ مَوْلَانَا He is our Lord. He is our caretaker. وَعَلَى اللَّهِ فَلْيَتَوَكَّلِ الْمُؤْمِنُونَ then we have the formula. This true dependence on Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala in these plights is what will get us through it, inshaAllah. The true dependence, like the scholars say, is to do everything in your power as if it's the only thing that will benefit you. And then to depend on Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala in the fullest as if everything you've done will not do anything for you. So in one sense, you do everything you can, and in the other sense, you're in complete dependence on Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala because you know that everything that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala puts in our way is a test. We are tested them with, with, good, with good things and with hardships so that they may return, so that they may reflect upon who they are in relationship to the vastness and to the greatness of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Knowing at the end, that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala وَإِنْ يَمْسَسْكَ اللَّهُ بِضُرٍ فَلَا كَاشِفَ لَهُ إِلَّا هُمْ وَإِنْ يُرِدْكَ بِخَيْرٍ فَلَا رَادَّ لِفَضْلِهِ That the matter of the believer is always in good. That if he's tested, he's patient and persevering. And if he's given bounties, he's to use them in the service of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Let us all, inshaAllah, repent and, re and, and return to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and say like our beloved sallallahu alayhi wa sallam used to say, يا حي يا قيوم برحمتك استغيث يا حي يا قيوم برحمتك استغيث السلام عليكم